Hello, hi, and welcome. Today, I bring you a first look at a fun alpha I got to play called King's Hunt. King's Hunt is made by Vaki Games, and it is a 5v5 tower defense game with some MOBA elements added into it. You can play as either attackers or defenders in a match where you must take down or defend the Guardian. As defenders, your main goal is to protect your Guardian from the attackers until the timer runs out. You do this by placing towers, barricades, along all the lanes. Um, you want to set up these defenses to keep the attacking minion waves at bay and hold the enemy heroes as best as you can. If you get the attacking side, you will get to choose what lanes minions spawn in. Minions will either spawn as basic minions or orc minions. Uh, you will have to help protect those minions up until they reach the Guardian so that they can help you take them out. Currently. There are four main characters of the game that you can pick from in a lobby. There is the Demigod, the Knight, the Enchantress, and Legina. Um, you can pick any number of combinations of these heroes at the moment, as your teams are 5v5 and there's only currently four. Uh, the Knight is your main tank, and he helps you take down towers on the attacking side and can actually help heal them on defense. The Demigod is a teamfight controller with his crowd control abilities and heavy damage. He will also help you take down towers, but he also can help turn the tide of a team fight with his massive CC abilities. Lagina is the support slash healer of the group. She will help your team last longer in fights with her single target and AoE heals. The Enchantress, which is personally my favorite, is a burst mage of the group. She has long range and high damage attacks. This will allow her to take out enemies quickly while staying a little bit away from the fights. While playing the alpha, I had a ton of fun. It feels more polished and runs smoother than some betas I've been a part of, and it's only an alpha. If this is their starting point, I can't wait to see what their game looks like when it is more polished. I was a little wary of a tower defense aspect um, that King's Hunt introduces into the mobile world, but after playing it, I find it to be really enjoyable, heavy hitting, super tactical, and addicting. The characters, while there's only four of them at the moment, are unique to each other so that I can get a different experience no matter which one I decide to play. I found that no matter if I got the attacking or defending side, I felt confident that I could win the game if I played correctly, and I felt that I was still impactful no matter which side of the map I ended up being on. While the game looks really nice and runs well for an alpha test, there are some things I personally would like to see just enhanced a little for the future. Uh, things like visual sounds and cues. I think sometimes in team fights it can get a little hectic when only relying on the motions of your heroes to decipher kind of what is happening in a fight. I would really love to see more status indicators in a match, whether that be for a stun, blind, healing, or any CC added in the future. I know there are some currently right now, but it's very minimal. Lagina herself is really, really fun to play, but I had a tough time using her abilities, um, such as like her single target heal seems to prioritize who is ever closest to me rather than who I'm trying to aim at. It gets a little hectic in team fights, so even if a person isn't necessarily right next to me, I would like to be able to heal whoever I'm aiming at just because they might need it more than the person that's like right next to me. <laughs> I also think that her ranges are really short. It feels like I have to be right next to my allies to target them for heals, or even right next to an enemy to land the blind ability. Uh, I'm not saying make her ranges as long as football fields, but slightly bigger could probably help her out with her positioning in team fights to help sustain the team more as well. One of the biggest issues I did have with the game was the body blocking. It feels super harsh. It's like if I slightly nudge a minion, it's like I'm running into a brick wall and I just stop. I've already sent this feedback to the developers and they've taken it really, really well. I just wanted to add it in here for clarification of what I've experienced. All in all, King's Hunt was really fun. I like the direction it's currently going in and I can't wait to see what else they're releasing in the future. So far they've teased a new hero called the Prosecutor who from first glance kind of looks like he's another tank just to kind of add him into the mix. So I'm really looking forward to their next playtest and recommend anybody to try this game out. Uh, and if you don't like it, it's free anyway, so you really have nothing to lose. Let me know if you liked me doing this kind of video as I may do more in the future. And of course, like, comment, and subscribe if you kind of feel like it. If not, it's fine too. <laughs> Um, but I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching. Bye. Good. That's that's gonna be in there. Yeah. You're welcome.